Alright guys, today I'm going to show you how I use my recovery and toe strap. Now, if you've seen in my previous videos, I have a D-ring uh, bracket mounted in the front of my truck for a 3 fourths D-ring. And in the rear of my truck, I have a 2-inch uh, receiver set up for a 3 fourths D-ring. Now, I'm going to show you how I use both of them with my toe strap. And then I'm going to show you an easy and expensive way to use your 2-inch receiver to use a toe strap. So stay tuned, guys. All right, guys. Let's say I got the D-ring bracket mounted here in the underneath the bumper. Um, I've got these rubber insulators to keep it, the D-ring from moving around in the bracket. So when I did that, it made it to where it's hard to take the D-ring on and off and still put the rubber insulators back on. So it's a tight fit. So I'm gonna show you what I do to do this setup. It takes a little longer, but it still works. out of it. There you go guys. Now you're ready. Now you can uh, either recover or tow your vehicle. Go ahead and check out the back. guys in the back it's a little easier this d-ring comes off so let me get the toe strap and we'll put it on okay guys take the d-ring off around a lot easier right <laughs> Rubber insulators. Now you're good to go. Now you don't have this set up. This is a little cheaper setup. Take your pitch receiver pin. It's open. Straps open. Let me stick it in. Put it through. Now you can use this set up with just your basic hitch pin. You don't have a lock. You don't have to use a lock pin, but I have a lock pin. Now you're good to go. guys hope this helps you guys out and as always thanks for watching and have a good one